The last tip is think about how to create or improve a habit with something called temptation bundling. Um, so temptation bundling is a term that I learned from James Clear in his book, Atomic Habits. Let's see, I actually have it right here. You guys can see it. Um, highly recommend this book. It's actually super, super helpful in our intermittent fasting journey. I'm almost tempted to even just do like a, like a video of just atomic habits, intermittent fasting version. <laughs> um, but what temptation hand bundling is, is how do you create a habit or how do you make a habit of something that you don't really want to do? So I'll give you an example of this. I suck at water, suck at drinking water, and it just, it's really hard for me to do it. Now, when I have it as a focus point and goal, the way that, so temptation bundling means that you pair two things. One thing you don't want to do with something that you do want to do. So an example of this, I don't want to drink water, but I love coffee, right? I am not allowed to drink my first cup of coffee until I've had my first water bottle of water, which is about 33 ounces. So I have to have my first bottle of water before I can have my cup of coffee. That's temptation bundling. When you do this enough times, you're associating this, you know, at the start negative thing with a positive thing. And eventually you don't look at it as a negative thing. That is temptation bundling. Um, you know, another example, and then there's something called temptation, uh, Habit stacking, that's another term. Habit stacking is when you take these bundles and you pair them. So um, I, this isn't related to intermittent fasting, but I want to read more. I want to, you know, consume more information and I wasn't really prioritizing it. So my habit stacking is when I drink my coffee, I'll sit down on my balcony and I'll read a book for like 30 minutes. So. So now temptation bundling needs habit stacking. So I can't have my first cup of coffee until I have my first water bottle. Then I'll have my cup of coffee while I'm having my coffee and reading my book. Now I'm doing this every single day. A new habit has been formed. Now I'm not thinking about the water bottle anymore as this negative thing. And I'm now doing all these things the first thing in my morning and I feel great. So what you wanna do is you wanna go through what is the thing that you wanna focus on doing and how do you create a temptation bundle out of it? Um, and you know, for example, if you say you hate tracking, right? You don't want to track for the first two weeks. If you track, um, you will uh, have a meal that you haven't had in ages and you'll treat yourself to that in your next eating window. I don't know. I'm just like throwing out examples of, of things that you can do, like little treats or things that you want to do that you can turn a negative experience into a positive experience. All right, guys. So that is my tips on how to optimize progress, how I think about it. Um, hopefully that has been helpful to you. If it has, please let me know.